Hi everybody, it's Rhiannon. Welcome back to Mama Replans. Today I'm gonna to be filming a memory plan with me from November 23rd through November 29th. I'm going to be using this really stinking adorable kit from Sticker Guru called Baby Yoda. So, so cute. Let's look at all the pages. Here we have the bottom washi and some cute little baby Yodas and some functional stuff on the side. Then we have a sidebar tracker, some more Yoda stuff and uh, some headers. And then a gorgeous page of foiling. So pretty. And this is in silver foiling. And then the date covers. And these are headers up here, but they're cut really, really thin. So I don't know. Do I, ha do I need to pull headers? I do, y'all. I do. Let me be right back. When you're planning with a sticker guru kit and you don't have headers, you might as well pull in the sticker guru headers because they're amazing and um, they're gorgeous. So now that I'm out of breath because, you know, I need to lose weight, let's get into the plans. I'm gonna lay down the base and lay down the headers and we will be right back. Talk amongst yourselves. Leave comments down below. Don't get too verklempt. You may be asking yourself, Rhiannon, I've never heard you talk about Star Wars. Why on earth are you using a Star Wars kit? Well, you know what, guys? I will tell you the reason why. It's because my adorable godson, Jordan, his birthday is on the 27th, and his birthday party was on the 28th, and we celebrated him, and his birthday was a Star Wars theme. So your girl had to pick up a Star Wars kit. And I picked up Baby Yoda, even though I probably should have just picked up like a normal Star Wars kit. But I don't really know any of the other characters besides Han Solo and, and now I know Baby Yoda. So, Baby Yoda won. Because let's be real, he's just so cute. So stinking cute. So there's the reason why. What am I doing here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight boxes, so I, I only need seven. Um, I'm not gonna use this froggy one. Yeah. One, two, three, so, okay. Got it, sorry, I just needed a minute. Needed to get my life together figure out what I was doing. So cute, baby Yoda. No, don't wanna use that one. Let's go with this one. So yeah, I don't really know much about Star Wars and I know I said I was gonna speed through this part but I just had to talk because I'm talkative tonight. So I am not a big Star Wars fan, but you know, the things you do for your godson, and he's freaking adorable. What am I doing? I'm like messing up here. I got like sticker, sticker land on my hand now. Hey, that rhymed. I didn't really want both of those there but it's gonna be, the, the third one is gonna be there anyway. So, anyway, I'm just a hot mess. I'm a hot mess. Baby Yoda, baby Yoda. So his mama Sam, she had um, like, an, a, the, the theme was really, really cute. We had chocolate covered, um, 
pretzels, pretzel rods, which were like considered lightsabers, which I thought was so stinking cute. And they were delicious, like let's be real. Then um, we had some yummy, yummy food. And his shirt said, the force is strong with this one because he was turning one years old. So it was just really stinking cute. Um, just so, so cute. She made like this gorgeous banner to go behind him or like for on the wall. It was really, really cute. So cute. So cute you guys and I finished a sheet of sticker guru headers so hot dog to that so let's get started with our plans this was a very exciting week because I had the week off so woohoo for sure and I'm not gonna use any of the headers and I'm probably not gonna use a sidebar either I'm probably just going to put little baby Yoda deco on the side. So let's do that really quick. And I don't know what the deal with this frog is, but we'll include him too. Might as well. Don't want to leave anybody out. And of course we have to put baby Yoda in this cute little pod. Because apparently that's a thing. I don't know. And then I have one baby Yoda left. Let's see if I can tuck him in at the top here somehow. Baby Yoda, he will fit right there. Cute. So yeah, that's good. Let's move on. So, um, Monday, again, I have the day off. So let's put that in faux show. Let's find a, use one of these little, um, like washi strippies. So I pulled a, a day off and a vacation but I'm gonna use the day off because it's green and it kind of matches the kit. So Monday was my first day off because I was off that, this Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and then Thursday, Friday, we had off for normal, like our company was closed. So Monday, we got a couple things done that I needed to get done. And why are you in here? You are not the right color. Um, so let's see. Um, Lauren had a tech call because her computer was not working. So let me find a box for that. Basically, like the school, um, if your computer's not working, they try and like troubleshoot it for you. But then eventually when they can't troubleshoot it anymore, they like have you call for like a, re a, um, like a new one. So I had to call for a new one for Lauren because, or they were, you know, or still trying to troubleshoot it and they weren't successful. So um, I had a call with the tech team on that day. And then I got lots of happy mail in the afternoon. Oh, I just realized I didn't put the day covers down. Hold the phone. Hold the phone, please. Oh no, I'm gonna cover up the baby Yoda. That was bad planning on my part. I'm sorry, Yoda. I'm sorry, baby Yoda. 
I know not what I do. I don't even know what Baby Yoda would say to me right now. Ashamed of you I am, or I am, right? Ashamed of you I am is how he would say it, I think. There we go. Okay, phew, now I can relax for a moment. Cause yeah, I don't know, I don't know what I was thinking. Totally messed that up. So anyway, um, I cleaned the kitchen, the, my hubby put the tree up, our Christmas tree up, so that was super exciting. I was very excited for that. So let's put a box down for that in the afternoon. Because, you know, love me some Christmas. No! Ah! Wanted to put it down lower. There we go. Um, we got some groceries. Some groceries. So let's put down, I'm not even gonna put a box down for the groceries. I'm just gonna put, um, put them down with a little, a little groceries icon and a little girl. Cause she cute. Even though she has blonde hair, but we know, we're not gonna hate on her. Because, you know, we've all had blonde hair at one point in our lives. And then this one was for some cleaning. So I'm going to put a spray bottle there because I cleaned the kitchen. And then I'm going to put this little vacuum here because I steamed vacuumed the carpet. So, woohoo, go me, I rock. And then here I refilled a prescription. So we're just going to snug this little guy in there. And then I, I, apparently I got a lot of Happy Meal. I don't recall such a thing, but it, it happened. I put on here lots of Happy Meal. So apparently this day I got lots of Happy Meal. I don't recall again what it was, but I hope it made me happy. And moving on to Tuesday, the 24th. Again, I was off again. So that was very exciting. Oh, and... Monday, I had a chiropractor appointment that I totally missed, so that stinks. Um, and I spent a lot of the day, not a lot of the day, but a little bit of the day finalizing any grocery orders for this day, which I did place. So I did an online grocery order for this next day. So yeah, and I played, this was from Aldi. Um, that was an order that I did for pickup because Aldi has the potatoes I like and other stores don't have the Yukon Gold. I don't know why, because they're freaking delicious, and I don't know why they don't have them, but they don't, so I ordered them from Aldi. So there is that, and let's see. Um, so the most important thing that happened on Tuesday was that we had Merry Maids come, so I'm gonna put a big box on here for this, because I was, really freaking excited to have Mary Maids come. Thank you, Mom. Thank you, Matt. Alexa, clean my house. I thought that was appropriate since I was the one who was not cleaning. And I have this cute little girl here. <laughs> oh my, that's probably horrible. But it's the truth. That's that's literally how I felt. So um, then I got some more Happy Mail. I picked up more groceries, and um, the girls had a friend sleepover, so that was super fun because she's just the darlingest. Miss Lily, I told her she's allowed at any time. So did I tell her that? I hope I told her that because she's totally totally welcome anytime because she's just so sweet so I'm gonna use a little flag for for Lily sleeping over we're gonna put that down here and I got some cute little some cute little slippers and a cute little eye mask for them sleep for Lily sleeping over I just thought that was darling 
So that was cute. Then um, I did get some groceries in the afternoon again. So let me see here if I can layer this at all. Yeah, that works. So here's some groceries. I'm gonna put this up a little bit. Some groceries. Then the kids went to my mom's while the maids came. So I'm gonna put this little box down here for that. And I'm running into my stickers, my big belly. Not because I'm pregnant, just because I'm fat. But they're catching on the edge of the table, so yeah. No, don't want you there. I want you on this side. And then I got some Happy Meal again. Guilty as charged. And then apparently I had some some Sadie Snuggles. So I think the Sadie Snuggles are going to trump the um, are going to trump the the mail. I love me some Sadie Snugs. And I just put this little word down here that said cuddles. I should have put a puppy. Where's my puppy? Do I have a little paw print? Oh yeah, there we go. I'm gonna add this little paw print from Murdoch Talks. There we go, that is just perfect. Love it, love it. And then I think I have just enough room to put a little Happy Meal sticker in there. I actually really like that. I don't hate it. That is everything. Oh, and then I got to watch um, Lotsies with Lakin. We can snug this down, that down there too. And another thing that happened on um, Tuesday that was exciting that I'm going to try and just snug up in here. I was answer, offered the uh, council seat for church. Um, what the heck, Pen? Why are you doing me like this? <laughs> My Sharpie S gel, are you running out? What are you doing? <laughs> nope, not running out. I don't know what's the deal with this pen, but it's not writing very well. So that makes your girl sad. Hopefully it'll come back to life when I actually need to write stuff in here. I just didn't want to forget that because I didn't really have like a sticker. So anyway, so moving on to Wednesday. Um, so yeah, anything, let's see, anything else that happened on Tuesday? Um, I called and scheduled some more appointments with my therapist. Since I had off the kids, I had to bring, um, pick up kids supplies in the afternoon. The kids went to my mom's for while the cleaners were there. Again, I think I already said that. Then moving on to Wednesday, I have this really fun little sticker because I was prepping some food all dang day. And I'm gonna layer this. Let's just find something to layer this on. So this was to show that I was prepping food all day. Not all day, but a lot of the day. That's cute. I don't mind the layering on that. I like it. I like it a lot. And then I slept in. I was up by 7.30, so it wasn't too bad, but I got to sleep in. Then Miss Sadie had a um, grooming appointment, so that was fun. She really needed that for sure. So we got that little sticker in there, if I can get it straighter. There we go. Oh, and I, um, I don't know why I have so many stickers for the dog, but apparently I do. So hold on a moment. Let me just get all my little stickers in here for the dog. <laughs> I got a Sadie, I got a grooming sticker, and I got a dog, a dog print. I don't know why I pricked so many, but I did, so. Um, then I had therapy in the morning, so let me find a little guy for that. How about this guy? That guy looks cute. I like it. I just pulled a little washi strip down there. I'm just going to snug this guy right in there because it was in the morning. There we go. Then the kids didn't have school. It was the first day of their fall break. So let me 
just put this, I don't know why I'm using another flag, but that's what we're doing. Fall break begins, cute. Then um, the girls and I went to breakfast. We went to a place called Tequila. No tequila happened. They did have Charito, Charito I think it's called. Um, but the girls and I went and had breakfast. And then I'm gonna snug this little guy in here because Lauren made some brownies. So, yeah. There we go. That's everything for Wednesday. So cute. Okay, moving on, moving on here. What are we moving on to? Thanksgiving, yum. Let me, um, did I miss anything? No, I didn't miss anything on Thursday, on Wednesday. Didn't miss anything, good. I need so, Thanksgiving, I don't have a ton of stuff to do to write down, so I got this full box from Rise and Plan, and I'm gonna put that in here because it's just gorgeous, and I think it looks really pretty. And um, I don't have a ton of stuff to mark for Thursday because we basically ate, drank, and were merry. And I relaxed, I went to bed early, and I was very tired because I have a little, so tired icon here from Cheerful Planner Girl. Little Miss Nixie, she's so tired. She wants to go and take a nap. And then we drew Secret Santa names. That was, that was fun. So let me put down this cute blue box here. Hopefully it'll fit. Will it fit? Do I need to snug it under Nixie? There we go. So that was fun. I'm very excited about who I got. I can't tell you because my kids watch my videos, so it will not be a surprise if they see my video. They'll be able to tell you who I got. Or they'll, you know, it won't be a surprise for them, is basically what I'm trying to say. So there is that. Um, I think I'm gonna put a little flourish in here, actually, because I think we have a little bit of room on the side. It may look weird, but if it does, just don't tell me, because it'll hurt my feelings. If it looks cute, tell me. If it doesn't, if it looks weird, just ignore me and pretend I never asked. Okay? Okay. Um, so then, moving on to Friday. Did a little bit of driving. Um, had to pick up something for Jordan's birthday. Um, because I had a friend who was gonna make his smash cake. So I drove to um, drove to Milwaukee to pick up something for his for the the supplies. Um, oh, actually, you know what? Hold on. Hold the phone. I want to put the balloons down first, then the happy birthday. There we go. Okay. So I drove to Milwaukee in the morning. Lauren came with me. We went to. Um, pick up something from Michael's. Then, um, actually first I had a grocery order at the crack of dawn because I had to pick up the stuff for the, to drop off. I had to drop off groceries to her and I had to drop off um, some piping bags so she could make the cake. So I had to go pick up the groceries, like the cake mix and all that fun stuff. So that was in the morning from eight to nine. Then Lauren and I drove to Milwaukee to grab the rest of the stuff. So I'm gonna put down one of these little fun boxes here. Then we drove to Rachel's house, dropped off the stuff, came back home, and did some online shopping, pretty much. Yeah, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much what happened the rest of the day. Um, the, the kids had game night at, at my sister's and my mom's. So thank you, TT. I'm just kidding, that really wasn't the rest of the day. But, um, so the kids had, had game night with my mom and my sister. They were so gracious to host. And the kids had super fun. And then Bailey picked them up um, when she was off of work. So they were there till, I don't know, 11 something. 
and then um, hubby and I went to his friend's house and had a game night. So, kids had a game night, parents had a game night. It was fun. We played um, Quick Wits, which is like an adult game where you basically have to have quick wits and you have to answer things really fast. And it was a lot of fun. So, so there's that. And that was Jordan's first birthday. So, yay. Yay, yay, yay. And then on Saturday, it was his birthday party. So that's gonna be this box here. And this is, I only pulled two stickers for this day. This happy birthday and this cupcake. That was it. I didn't pull any other stickers for Saturday. <laughs> which is okay, which is totally okay. Um, because we really, honestly, that's the only thing I have on my, on my planner, on my notes, is that it was Jordan's first birthday. So, it was a very chill day. That one of those days where you're like, God, I don't wanna get ready, but I have to get ready. And like, like you wanna get ready because it's like something fun, but you're being really lazy and you don't want to. So then your hair ends up being in a messy bun for his party but he's only one, so he can't really tell. So it's not like a huge deal, you know? That's basically how the day went. Um, but it was really cute. He didn't, get, he didn't get super into his cake like I thought he would. Um, the cake was friggin' adorable though. Rachel did an amazing job. Um, I did drive to her house Saturday morning to pick up the cake. So that was basically how the morning was spent. So I guess they can mark that down. Then I drove to Rachel's to pick up his to pick up Jordan's cake. Um, but yeah, I slept in because we had, you know, we were out late the night before. We didn't get home until like um, two o'clock maybe in the morning. So, so yeah, we were a little tired, but um, overall it was good, good day for sure. So, and then, um, you know, chilled, went and picked up the cake went to Jordan's birthday party, came home. Then in the evening for dinner, um, we had euros. I totally forgot about that until just now. So let's put a box in there for euros because you know, euros don't happen every day. Gotta mark that. So yeah, we had euros for dinner. Um, I'm gonna write that in because I didn't write it in my book. So I'm probably gonna forget. Year rolls. They were delicious. And then on Sunday, I did online church. And that was it. The rest of the day was a chill day. And that's the only thing I have to write on Sunday too, is that I did online church. And then that was it. That was literally it. Um, I don't even think I touched my planner. I think, oh, and I did put, put, the, put my stuff back in order on my desk. Since we I had the day off, or the, the last week off, we had moved all of my computer stuff. And then, um, you know, I had to go back to work Monday. So had to move all my computer stuff back. Um, and I did get my EC seasonal surprise box that day. So we can mark that too. All these things I'm forgetting and just reminding me all of a sudden about And it was weird that it came on a Sunday, but it sure did. So that is everything that happened this week. Let me write in everything and we will be right back. Oh wait, I have this really cute sticker from Made With Southern Love. It, does, it totally doesn't apply to this week, but I wanted to put it down because it's just cute and it's Baby Yoda. So actually I think it's old yoga, oh, old Yoda, but it's Star Wars, so. We're gonna use it and it says, not my effing problem. So, let's put that on Sunday just because I have a little bit of space there. Totally not related at all to church. Just putting that out there. Um, Cause I love church. And again, I'm reaching for something that doesn't fit. Get out of here, gold. It's a silver spread we're dealing with here. 
I'm just gonna put a little flourish. A little guy right there. Because I can. Okay, so I'm gonna write in everything and then we will be right back. And I think I'm gonna go get a different pen because I don't think this pen is gonna cut it. There we go. <sighs> don't use a gel pen when you really need the big guns, AKA a Sharpie. Okay guys, that is everything. Let me do a little wiggle here for you. So pretty. I love all the foiling on here. The delicate boxes that are foiled, the glitter headers in between, some of my little scripts here, so pretty. I love it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please let me know if you're a Star Wars fan or not down below. Um, and if you are a Star Wars fan, who's your favorite character? Because um, I'm curious. And um, also, if you have any recommendations for what movie I should start if I want to start watching the Star Wars franchise, what movie I should start on. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I can't wait to plan with you guys next week. Bye, guys.